Well, afternoon all. First things first, I'm surprised I didn't still know how to work these bloody cameras. It's been a while since I've used them or done any filming. Um, it was back in March, I bloody came off the bike and broke the shoulder, so it's been a fairly quiet um, time since then. So, but hey, all good now. The boys are keen to go for a hunt, so we're off. Although, geez, look at that weather. Uh, hunting in good weather is fine, but it's an absolute scorcher in Wanganui here today. So it's going to be even hotter on the hill. We're going to head up the mountain, see if we can find a deer or two, or one or two anyway. Um, I don't have to be too greedy, but geez, also moved house recently, so the shed is just a jumble. That's the first mission, finding all my gear in there. So yeah. That's going to be, I'll probably bound to leave something behind, I always do, and that's when I know where everything is, let alone when everything's a bloody mess. So yeah, we're going to head up, um, it's getting later in the day, but um, there's no need to get up there super early, and we can't anyway, because the um, the main highway is shut south of um, National Park at the Makatoti Viaduct, so um, yeah, we're just going to toodle on up there, hopefully we don't have to wait in the queue too long and get through all the traffic, because no doubt there'll be heaps, and hit the hills and... See if we can find something. Um, look at that weather. It should be all out this evening, even um, even if not at the last bloody light anyway. So we'll go up there and set up and see what we can find. Be good to go stretch the legs anyway. I'm wanting to test out the shoulder and the legs. I'm bloody unfit, so I know that much. So it's good just to go for a walk anyway and see what happens. Oh well, we'll see you up there somewhere. See you soon. Nice fat hind has decided to show herself for the evening. Oh, there's another one. Didn't see that one hiding. I knew there'd be another one somewhere. They shouldn't be by themselves at this time of the year. Oh, there's another one. He's like a... He's a bit of a mutant. It looks like he's got four on one side and only two on the other. See that other one now, it's gone. Yeah, up down, get yourself comfortable. stags together. Connor's thinking about having a shot at that young stag.
Someone's gonna have a shot. So put your finger at least round the where the trigger is. Okay. Well maybe you can slide the gun forward and back as well. behind its front leg, it'll be fine. Just put it down. Just like, oh, it to the right of the well, Connor hopefully might have got a stag. It's eight o'clock, we've got a hour of light, so we're gonna not muck around, we'll get over there and get it. What do you think, Tom Tom? Good. Something here. Yeah, you would have seen from the footage it but ducked down, it got it's definitely hit. So um pack up the gear and get over there. Well, we're in the land of the toy toys now. So we've got to head up there somewhere. Let's go to the, to the side of that ridge. Hill there, and then yep. up the middle. There are some, I've been up there a few times, there are some comfy bits. But right, what's the furthest you've shot? I'm sure not much further than that. You're going to have to most guns can shoot a long way, it all comes down to the operator and use of you know, getting used to the firearm. The 308 used to hold a lot of records for the thousand yard competitions. It wouldn't take long to start shedding gear. That, the 
joys of bush lawyer. Beautiful country in here. Me. Where's the deer, Stella? Stella? Where's the deer? Good girl. Right, we just gotta go up on top of that up there and it should be not far away. Well, those are the two pungas on this clearing. So fingers crossed. I think it went down in this, fell down into this gut because I could see it between those two pungas. Stella, where's it? Where you going? Where's it here? Good girl, good girl. Where's it? Where's it? Oh, I see it. stuffed but it never bit. How's that for reactions? I think it's stuffed but you never can be too sure. It's a dead deer. I'm sure everybody knows. But one way of telling you if a deer's dead or not is by touching its eye. If its eye doesn't blink, it's dead. Did you boys know that? Awesome. Connor's first stag. Oh, That's awesome. Well done. Right, we're running out of light, so it's going to be a very quick bone out, photo and bone out session. So we'll get into it. Yeah, they will. They'll be awesome. Let's go. Right, that's it. Deer boned out. Moon just coming up. Dog happy. Boys with a load on. Now we've got a bush bash into it.